today I'm going to talk about how to create a blog post on Serenity Smile Designs website. First off, we have to go to our website address, which will be given to you later, as well as a login credential. That's what we do is we log in. And once you get to here, you'll see a few options. You may or may not have access to all of them. But for today's purposes, what we're looking for is into the blog admin. Now, as you can see, there's a lot of different icons over here. Post gives us a list of all the posts that we've done, as well as the ability to add new. It also has a quick draft, which is just a quick post that we typically don't use that often. Media is a way for us to add lot, you know, photos, videos, whatever, link. We can add a hyperlink to another website or a video, whatever it is we want. Pages is a link to all of the dental pages that we have. More than likely, you won't be able to access it from this particular window. So for today, we're gonna to go to post, and we're gonna add new. Okay. So first thing we're gonna do is take our title. Now on this right screen, I've already made the article, so I'm really just gonna copy and paste it. Copy and paste. And for the paragraph in here, I'm going to do the same thing. I'm going to scroll all the way down. Again, copy and paste. Now at this point you can see that everything kind of starts to get a little bit long. So at this point what we can do is somewhere in here, and you can hit this button which is a read more tag. And that just means you'll have to click on the button once you're reading in order to read the rest of this article. So we can get rid of that. Another thing that we can do as well is we can insert media or photos. Okay. So I've already taken a couple and from this right screen I've basically taken a photo and I'm dragging it into here. And that takes us to the media file over here and automatically opened up this gallery. Make it known, it's a media file. And it'll give us an option of changing the size, shape, and location. For now, I'm not going to add title captions or anything like that, but we can look at that later. Alignment, if we want to left it, we're on the left, center, or the right. Uh, in this case, we'll probably put it on the left. And as soon as that loads up, we'll just insert it into the post. And this is where we can choose the size. Thumbnail is really small, medium, large, or full. Typically, in this case, we'll go with medium. And you can see, there it is. Now, I'm going to want to move this up a bit. Let's see if it will let me. Put it here for now. And we'll probably put it way up at the top. We don't need two, so we'll leave just one. Now, there are a couple others. Another thing we can do as well is set a featured image. In this case, we'll actually use the one we just put in. And when we go ahead and publish, that will be the image that comes up for us. And there's actually two other photos that I wanted to bring over. So I'm going to drag them over at the same time.
and there's one. Here's our second. So it's still uploading a bit. Now we can go ahead and insert that into the post. And you can see basically the image here. We have the other images as well. Our featured image has already been set. And we can put categorize this under blog. And that's pretty much it for now. I'll go in and redesign this a little bit later, but for purposes of today, we get an idea of pretty much where we're going. So I'll go ahead and edit this, but for now, I'll save this as a draft. Typically, you would just publish, but for now, I'm gonna save it, just like edit a little bit more, keep this video from getting too long.